I begin my pilgrimage in Quebec City on the AML River Shuttle. Okay, so we've gotten off the River Shuttle and I highly recommend it. It was just a really nice one hour cruise along the St. Lawrence River and it drops you off right here. I can see Alright, we've got the beautiful St. Anne Basilica behind me and I'm going to be taking you on a tour. I have a map and I've mapped out what I want to want to do and share with you. And um, this is a famous uh, pilgrimage basilica. It's been here for 350 years. Um, it is the oldest pilgrimage site in North America. The, the, Euro the French brought it here and um, a little bit on St. Anne. She is the grandmother of Jesus and um, this pilgrimage site is more than just about a religion it's also about um, people coming for a healing it's now it's known for miracles happening here so my intention is first of all I don't ascribe to any one religion however that, that that's okay so I'm just here to set intention and, and pray for my own personal reason. And mine is personal. It's not anything to do with physical healing. It's to do with healing internally. So um, I have that to, to guide me through this experience. So anyway, I'm really looking forward to this. It's a beautiful site and it's more than just a basilica. It's a complex and you will soon find out what that's all about. So we're going to start first here in the um, the yard around the uh, gardens and flowers and the fountain and show you around and then we'll take you inside and by the way it is all free so all right so here we go As you can see, it's a beautiful place to just walk around and contemplate. Um, beautiful flowers, beautiful fountain, and uh, sculptures as well. All right, so I'm, I'm ready to go inside and um, of course I'm going to be silent in there so I will record a narration later and it's good to stop at this visitor center first and uh, I'm, I'm going to first take you upstairs to the basilica that has the statue of St. Anne and then I will go downstairs to the um, Immaculate Conception Chapel and that has some really interesting things too and then various other sites on the grounds here. Okay, here goes.
coming outside on the other end of the building. I'm going to go and show you the various other sites, such as chapels. As you can see, it's pretty windy here. Um, but uh, here we go. Okay, so this is the Memorial Chapel. It was built in 1876. has souvenirs from the original chapel. Aww. Humble little humble little chapel. Behind the chapel on the hill is the Way of the Cross. This takes you on a journey of the Passion of Jesus, depicted in 14 stations with bronze statues. samples of stones from the Holy Land. to 
great. My grandmothers were in my heart today and I had that intention because 